Apple is moving towards its goal of being carbon neutral by 2030 by adding 9 gigabytes of clean energy and doubling the number of its suppliers. How will this goal be achieved? Let's talk about Apple's plan on the path to becoming carbon neutral in today's video. But first, please like and subscribe to this channel and then sit back and relax. How is Apple carrying out its plan to become carbon neutral? Apple announced it has doubled the number of suppliers that have committed to using 100% clean energy over the past year, accelerating progress towards its ambitious goal of becoming carbon neutral by 2030 in the entire supply and production chain. A total of 175 Apple suppliers will switch to renewable energy, with the company and its suppliers adding more than 9 gigawatts of clean energy around the world. With these actions, more than 18 million metric tons of CO2 per year will be avoided, which is equivalent to removing nearly 4 million cars from circulations per year. The company has added 10 new projects to its groundbreaking Power for Impact initiative, which will deliver clean energy solutions around the world. These projects are designed to bring renewable energy to low-income communities while promoting economic growth and social impact. Every business should be involved in the fight against climate change, and together with us, with our suppliers and local communities, Apple is demonstrating the opportunity and equity that green innovations can bring urgently and they are doing it together. But time is not a renewable resource, and the company must be quick to invest in a greener and more equitable future. Although Apple is already a carbon neutral company in all of its global operations, by 2030 all devices sold by Apple will have a net zero climate impact. After Apple announced this goal last year, it has not only dramatically increased the number of suppliers turning heads with renewable energy, but the company also increased the number of recycled materials in its product and established new projects based on environmental justice. Apple managed to reduce its carbon emissions by 40% in the last five years. For many years, the communities most affected by climate change had not had a seat at the table. That has to change, and Apple is committed to being part of that change. The new project that Apple shares will have communities by developing new local renewable initiatives to create a healthier and more equitable world, and at the same time, advance in the fight against climate change. Apple's Supplier Initiatives In the US, Solvay, one of the 19 suppliers that are part of Apple's Supplier Clean Energy program, is expanding the use of renewable energy in its operations with Apple, and in many cases, in its business with other companies as well. In Europe, 19 suppliers are now a part of the program including SD Microelectronics, which has initiated nine additional projects to supply renewable energy to its various operations since joining Apple's program. In China, 50 providers are already participating, and many of them are maximizing the use of solutions in their facilities. More than 31 suppliers have joined in India, Japan, and South Korea, including SK Hynix, one of the first Korean suppliers to join. Apple is also creating new options for using recycled materials while maintaining its high sourcing standards and working with suppliers to move towards a circular economy that eliminates the need for carbon-intensive mining and conserves Earth's resources. This includes recycled sources of gold, cobalt, aluminum, and rare earth elements in addition to other materials that are not part of Apple products. These advances, along with suppliers transitioning to renewable energy, are reducing the environmental impact of Apple products. Key achievements include an 11% reduction in the carbon footprint of the iPhone 13 Pro and an 8% reduction in the 16-inch MacBook Pro compared to previous generations. Apple's support to communities Apple is also announcing its support for 10 new renewable projects around the world through its program Power for Impact. In the United States, Apple will work with Osadi Sakowin Power Authority, made up of six Sioux tribes, to jointly develop tribal renewable energy resources by financing, developing, constructing, and operating power generations and transmissions facilities for the wholesale market. This project is on track to create large-scale wind power development in the Midwest and follows the Power Authority participating in the Apple Impact Accelerator, part of the racial equity and justice initiative of the company. In South Africa, Apple is helping bring renewable energy to more than 3,500 homes that previously didn't have access. The company will also help reduce electricity costs at the Pioneer School for the visually impaired by funding rooftop solar installations. And in Nigeria, Apple will support the development of a solar system that will power a primary care center in Ondo State as well as 200 households in the neighboring community. In the Philippines, Apple will help finance an educational institution that offers scholarships to high-achieving low-income students by offsetting electricity costs through a new rooftop solar installation. In Thailand, Apple is part of an initiative to increase renewable energy productions and battery storage to ensure reliable access to electricity, while replacing the use of polluting diesel fuel in a remote fishing village that relies on refrigerators to maintain the quality of its products. 
Apple's initiative to fund programs in Vietnam will provide solar electricity to 20 schools across the country and teach thousands of children about sustainable development in science, technology, and math. In Colombia, Apple is helping to get the solar system up and running on the roof of the Santa Ana Hospital, and the money the hospital saves on electricity bills will buy more equipment and medicine. In addition, the solar installations on the roof of Ciudad Don Bosco, a nonprofit institution that offers educational and social services to at risk youth, will help the group advance its sustainable development goals. In Israel, Apple is helping the Nitzana Educational Eco Village for at risk youth with solar installations that will offset electricity costs and generate a new source of income for the organizations. The company will continue to focus on the communities most affected by climate change in its effort to achieve its environmental goals. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit like, the subscription button, and the notification bell to get notified when new videos are uploaded from this channel. Do well to share your thoughts about Apple's ingenious plan to become carbon neutral in the comment section below.